In this question, we are told that the braking distance is directly proportional to the square of the speed. We need to find the braking distance of the car when it's traveling at 32 meters per second. In the previous part of the question, we found that when the car travels at 20 meters per second, the braking distance is 30 meters. We will need this information in a minute. But first, let's write the direct proportion as a mathematical relation. So, the braking distance, which we can call d, is proportional to the square of the speed. And that can be v squared. This expression shows the proportionality. We can make this into an equation by writing a constant of proportionality, which we can call k. And that gives that the distance, the braking distance, is equal to a constant, which shows that there is direct proportion times the square of the speed. We can find this constant using the information that we already have. Putting the values from the previous question, we have 30 equals k times 20 squared. Rearranging this equation, we will get that k is 30 over 20 squared, which is 3 over 40. We now need to find the distance when the speed is 32 meters per second. So we can rewrite our equation with the known value of k. So we will have d is equal to 3 over 40 v squared. And substituting in the value of v, we will have 3 over 40 times 32 squared. And this will give us the distance, the braking distance, as 77 meters.